when I send half a day guys welcome back to my channel I am having combination pho and some egg rolls here I have all the fixins the basil back home we know this as oops we know this as mint but it's basil I believe or a mix anyway um, I have the fish sauce for the egg rolls I put the chamorro pepper so it's nice and spicy I'm going to be throwing these jalapenos into my soup, but, oh my gosh, I'm really excited. Let's get started. Thank you, Jesus, for this food. <laughs> so do you remember when I had my egg rolls and spring rolls? Do you remember that video? Did you see it? Well, this is what I held back from ordering. Combo pho. It's my favorite. Anyways, I got it now. Okay, so whenever I have my pho, I can't start eating until everything is mixed in. So, let's work on this real quick, okay? Want all those jalapenos in there. I like mine spicy. Get in there. Gotta squeeze my lime in here. I already added some of the the pepper that I put inside of the fish sauce. I put it in my soup already. <laughs> oh no, I forgot my dream. <laughs> I'll be fine. Lots of soup here. I was really in a hurry again. Okay. Does anyone else throw all of the basil into their soup? Because I do. Whatever, every time they bring out the the little fix of like all the mint leaves or basil leaves, I throw it all in. My mouth is watery. <laughs> Ooh, before I get started, you guys, see my shirt? Steady. Shout out to the Steady Movement. My friend from high school started his brand here in Las Vegas. We're both from Guam. Graduated from the same high school. But he's, I'm supporting him, guys. I will leave his uh, link in the description box below. So if you want to check it out, I encourage you to do so. Steady movement. Thank you so much for the gear. All right. Oh, and I like to do this too. Take a little bit of the fish sauce. Put it in my soup. I usually put more than that, but I've got to save some for my egg rolls. Let me fix my first bite. So this is the combo fuss. So it has tripe in there. It's got the brisket. It's got the fatty flank. It's got tendon. All the things, guys. Mm. 
We got cilantro in here. Mmm. So good. Anyway, here. First bite. I hope I can do this. The bomb. So good. So good. It smells so. Mm. Got some meat in there. Let's pick up the jalapeno. And it's still steaming, you see it? You guys, it could be 200 degrees in Las Vegas, and I will still eat hot soup. Guam, how are you guys doing? Are you excited about <clears throat> the island opening up for business again? I was able to call back home and, you know, ask some family and friends, like, what's the haps? What's going on? How is the soft opening going? Um, I mean, it's a good sign, right? Good sign, good sign. The nation is slowly but surely returning to work. Anybody else like tripe?
Oh man. You guys, the more I brainstorm ideas for my channel, <clears throat> the more passionate I become about, you know, supporting local uh, businesses. And by local, I mean anybody here in Las Vegas, you know, my friends, business, small businesses. Um, but especially like people from Guam. On Guam, from Guam, of Guam. <clears throat> I'm becoming more passionate about, you know, using my platform to help, um, you know, get my friends' businesses out there. I don't mind at all. And I don't know, for me, I just, I think it's important. So if you know anyone that has a small business and would like me to feature them or, you know, give a shout out, Please email me in the description. My information is in the description box below. Send me an email and we'll go from there, okay? Excuse me. You can even message me on Instagram at bookabang. Excuse me. It's at bookabang <clears throat> on Instagram. You can, you know, DM me there. And, um, yeah. Uh, be, you know, feel free to share this video with them, ask them to come on over, subscribe to my channel, and be sure to send me a message and we'll, like I said, I would love to shout out some local businesses. And shout out to Guam Food Blog. Thank you so much for featuring me again. I appreciate you. good bite. I got some tendon in there. Oh. <clears throat> I know my egg rolls are sitting there, but I don't even know if I want them right now. Egg rolls, we call this lumpia. Same, same, same. Mm. Mm -mm. 
It just ties everything together. Mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> Have you guys seen any of those um those pho challenges? Oh my gosh. It is pretty real. I think it's anywhere from like gosh, five five pounds and the bowls are gigantic. And they have these like <clears throat> competitions and if you eat it all I think if it's out of a restaurant you would get it for free but they do have these I think there's a legit um, pho eating competition <laughs> I mean I love noodles but I don't know if I would go to that length crazy Ooh, this is going to be so good. I need some fish sauce. Yes. It's a good piece of tendon right here. <clears throat> this is so bomb. you know when I watch other channels and they're eating noodles and everything a lot of people are taking like these really gigantic bites and I'm like oh my god how do you do that hold on I need a drink I mean, I can try, but <clears throat> I think it'll, it'll hurt. <laughs> to me, this is gigantic. Does it look gigantic? Does it look gigantic? Mm-hmm. <laughs>
I'm really looking forward to <clears throat> what's going to happen after this, after I'm filming this. I'm going to go and have like a little home spa treatment. <laughs> One of our friends is here. We're just going to do facials and stuff. <clears throat> I'm excited. Oh, this is going to be a good bite. There's like cilantro, green onions, and tripe in there. Ooh. I'm so curious about the people who don't like cilantro because it tastes like soap to them. That's so crazy. <clears throat> I love, love, love cilantro. Mm. When you eat pho, do you put hoisin, hoisin sauce in yours? Let me know. Comment below. Sometimes I do and sometimes I don't. I don't know. I knew I was hungry, but I didn't realize I was this hungry, guys. <clears throat> I had like one real, you know, sit down table meal today. And I was just snacking on other things. I had like the pickled papaya that I made. I had some cherries. Uh, what else did I have? I snacked on some chips. Oh, man. Quarantine. on the computer earlier today guys and I just opened another window went straight to YouTube clicked on my subscriptions and I just hit play I mean I was watching Be Love, Sass ASMR, Veronica Wang I was just watching all these channels but <clears throat> you know just going back and forth between that window and the other window that I was working on <clears throat> but sometimes I just let it play in the background while I'm doing stuff versus playing music. <laughs> but <clears throat> I need 
you know, just doing that alone, just um, playing the video, playing my video while you work on other things, like that definitely helps um, my channel grow too. So the next time you're doing some work on a computer or on your phone, just let my video play in the background and turn up your volume and just listen. I will be so grateful. <clears throat> Okay, so I was also watching, um, who is it? Casey Connection. And she was doing a challenge. Oh man, I forgot what, what it was. Was it a shrimp challenge and like the 210 spicy sauce? Ooh, I don't know. Timed challenge. I don't know if I can do that, guys. Any food challenge, I'm not sure if I could do it. <clears throat> I think someone in um, commented on one of my one of my uh, videos. Oh, it was my collab video, I believe. They want me to try doing a wasabi challenge. I am scared. I don't know. I'm scared of that one. I mean, I'll eat sushi for sure, but I don't know. <clears throat> the wasabi challenge, <laughs> it just, oh, it sounds painful already. All right, guys, I am filling up real good. I'm going to have this bite, and then the next one's going to be last bite because she is getting full. She's getting full. Oh yeah, I can do one more. This is gonna be last bite, best bite. <coughs> oh yeah, I'm so grateful for that one. I just made a little bit more room. All right, I'm gonna get my spoon in here to help so I can get the perfect bite. All right, some noodles. Ooh. Some tendon. I think I ate all of the basil leaves. Soggy cilantro. Green onions. I'm sure I ate all the tripe too. But that's all right. <clears throat> Food's meant to be eaten, right? Put a little bit of fish sauce. Okay. Here we go. Last bite. Best bite. Did I go too high? Can you guys see that? All right. I hope I can do this. Oh man. Mmm. Mmm. This was so good. Oh, hold on. I just need a few seconds to let that settle. Oh yeah. <clears throat> so good. All right.
right, you guys, don't forget, I will be leaving my friend's link for the study movement um, in the description box below. Don't forget to go and check him out. <clears throat> and with that, I'm going to sign off. Don't forget to like, comment, please subscribe, share my video, especially if you know any other local business in the Las Vegas area, anywhere stateside, I am willing to coordinate a destination feature, collab. But yeah, send them this video, have them watch it, and if they want, they can email me personally. My email information is in the description box below, don't forget. Uh, excuse me. All right, go tell your aunties, uncles, nieces, nephews, cousins, brothers, sisters, neighbors, and if you're from Guam, even Guelas and Guelas, tell them to come and watch. I'll see you guys in my next video. Adjust.